Alright, how's it going everyone? Zonabra here coming at you for another episode of a YouTube Diary. As you guys may have seen, if you guys are like regular viewers of this channel, I haven't uploaded in one or two days, I think two days. Um, and I kind of want to explain that and just talk a little bit about YouTube and how I'm feeling right now. Uh, I have started my fourth years of college to, um, like last week. And obviously, I'm going to have less time to do, like, recordings, uploadings, and all that stuff. And I had time to think. I had time to think. And this is so interesting because YouTube is, like, you, one day you feel like you're on top of the world. And, like, one day you feel like you have so much inspiration and you want to do content and you want to work hard and whatever. And the next day you feel like you feel like quitting. And... I hate, I hate, I hate, I don't like quitting on stuff that I pursue, of course, like, this is not something that feels good, but, and it's not a video of me telling you I quit, it's just a video telling me, like, I suck at YouTube, like, I, I had a, I had time to take a step back and just think about my YouTube journey and what I've accomplished over the last two to three years uh, of making videos, not daily, but just making videos in general, and it's also me comparing myself to others and other YouTubers in the, in the same genre that I do, but also in different genre. And I, I'm just like, yo, I, I suck at YouTube. Like, I don't, I'm not good at YouTube. Uh, what I offer, what I put on a table, the value that I offer to you guys, the audience, isn't there yet. And I don't think that I deserve any more views than I have right now. Uh, I'm, I'm not complaining about the number of views. I'm just, I'm just being honest with myself and being like, yo... If I have this numbers of views or this number of like attention or whatever, uh, there's a reason for that. Like, p good content always stands out, um, and I cannot just be like, okay, I just got unlucky because for a certain reason of time, I'm like, okay, one day YouTube will switch something on on the algorithm and it's gonna push my channel, and it's just it's just whatever is gonna happen is gonna happen, right? Because right now I'm seeing some channel blow up. I I'm seeing channels that are like. Not even blowing up, but let's say like close to 50k, 100k, and I'm not seeing any content that is like better than mine. But obviously, I'm kind of biased because my content is mine, and I think I thought that it was good. I thought it was bringing value on the table, and it, it's really not. It's really not. So I decided to change a little bit things up. I feel like the daily pursuit is not something that I want to start with. Like right now, I'm still at the first step of YouTube, the first thousand subscribers, and I don't think that starting with daily videos is a good thing. I think that you want to start with something maybe once a week, twice a week, see if people want more of that, and maybe do it like three, four times a week, see if people want more of that, and eventually do it daily. I think YouTube is a journey that you have to do step by step, and... You don't necessarily want to do it at the same rhythm as like PewDiePie or like all those daily people, because I feel like my my journey, like my stuff, was just like, okay, I'm gonna do a podcast, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna talk about the patch, and every time I don't have a topic, I don't have a I don't have an episode of like uh, random cues or stuff like this. I'll just give you a gameplay video of like a six seven minute highlight of one of my games. Uh, and just give you that and it would just be a filler for like 20 views uh, so that I felt better about myself giving me like giving me an extra day into the YouTube like just doing it daily and feeling better about myself just because I uploaded a video so all my YouTube career I want to say all my time on YouTube was about putting content quantity over quantity uh, quantity over quality and it's clearly not working. And after talking to some of my friend, after talking to like my brother or like people around me, um, I just have to f try something different. And for the first time, I'm gonna try to do quality over quantity. And hopefully, something will. I feel like you. It's just like YouTube is just like it's you going fishing almost. Like sometimes you have nothing. Sometimes you, you catch something. Sometimes you catch big big fish. I will see. I will go fishing with quality content and see if I can catch an audience, see if people can come back, and eventually see if people can ask them more. Uh, so what I want to do starting uh, right now, like as soon as you see this, guys, uh, every Sunday or every every weekend at least, I want to do one podcast. 
uh, I'm gonna have guests over. Uh, I want to learn about the community. I want to like I literally want to be able to invite people that has that are doing things in the. Whoa, why am I shaking the camera? I just want to invite people that are doing things in esports and gaming and just introducing you to them. Uh, just eventually meet them myself. Uh, but just talking about it. So if you guys have like if you guys have contacts or if you guys yourself like let's say you work in an esports organization you're like a game developer, anything in the gaming or esports related, like you work or like you do something and you want to present your project and you want to talk about your story and stuff like that, uh, hit me up, um, hit me up on Twitter, my DMs are always open and maybe we can go from that, uh, I think I have someone scheduled for this Sunday uh, and next Sunday, so that would be super fun, if I can't have a guest, then I'll just have a podcast by myself as I'm used to, and I will go over the news, over like esports event that came uh, like in the past week, uh, do some sort of like a top of the week event and just share my thoughts about some stuff that I'm following, and that would be just one thing, like that would be one content every week. The next thing I want to do is, uh, I just, I'm not sure what I want to do after this, like after the podcast thing, I'm really into podcasts right now, obviously like this, this could be considered a podcast, but it's almost like a diary for me, uh, just to keep track of shit, and I don't know, what else do I want to do, do I want to do gameplay of League of Legends, no, obviously nobody watches that anyway, uh, there's way better content out there for this, uh, do I want to do PUBG, I, by the way, I just bought PUBG, it's pretty fun, Maybe I post one or two videos of PUBG once in a while. If I feel like it, if I feel like, yo, this is cool content, it's easy to watch, why not? Like, uh, my first games of PUBGs are recorded. Maybe I'll just do a highlight to this and, and like, title the video, like, my first steps in PUBG. Uh, but I want to think, I, I, I want to find something as big as, uh, you know, like, like when James Corden introduced um, the carpool karaoke, like a concept. Like, I want to find and create a concept that would work and that I can be known for almost. Like, you have Complex with the sneaker shopping stuff. Uh, you have BuzzFeed that has, like, that compares price points on different stuff. Uh, all that are super interesting. Like, they're super intriguing and they want, they want, they make you want to watch it. Um, obviously, I don't have the production level of all those companies. But I want to try to make something interesting and unique uh, so that people come to my channel for this and this only and and not just do whatever the, whatever other people are doing and try to do like a little bit less like good. Because I feel like a lot of YouTubers are kind of doing the same thing. Some find success into it, some specialize in champions, some specialize in a different like uh, area, like they're trying to be funny or like super good or super serious. It's Everything is very like... It's, it's saturated. It's a saturated uh, stuff, at least for me. Uh, I feel like there's going to be a new League of Legends YouTubers this year, next year, and etc. Like some crazy guy that's going to play a crazy champion or whatever. Uh, but I don't know. I, I don't feel like it's the move. I don't feel like it's the move for me. So I'm just going to not take a break, but just think about a concept that I can do. Uh, podcasts will be every week. I love those. I really want to get in touch with people and just talk about esports and gaming. Uh, if you guys, if you guys want to present like, if you guys want to present like anything esports or gaming related, like let's say you want to do like a storyline about Bjergsen or Faker, you want to tell us his story, how he started to play League of Legends, blah blah blah, like anything, and you want to present it, you want to have like your little, uh, your little um, part on the podcast, uh, I'm down, bro. I'm really really down. So if you guys want to work with me on that, that would be great. And that's it. If you guys have any ideas, maybe uh, that you can communicate to me, why not? Uh, I'm also looking at different games on Steam for maybe a Let's Play. Uh, I think Let's Plays are really nice. I do watch these a lot, but I feel like a lot of people are already doing those. Um, so yeah, I just, I'm just i just going to look around. I'm always on YouTube, so I'm just going to look around, see what's up, and hopefully uh, I can spark an idea and, and make it happen. So thank you so much for listening for this YouTube Diary, guys. Uh, I hope you guys are doing well. Your week, weekend is going awesome. And I'll see you for the next video um, Sunday, I guess, or Monday. Cheers.